cheapest crappy fishing kit on Amazon challenge. Let's see what's in it. Okay, so we got a pretty decent little tackle box that it comes in. Decent latch. And I'm not too fond of these colors here, but this one and this one, maybe. And it comes with a handful of jig heads. Those look like probably 30 second ounce. But we got some of these little grubs here. Kind of mimic the Euro Tackle Fat Assassin baits. Whoops, that one rolled away. Yeah, these are very similar to the Euro Tackle Fat Assassin baits because they've kind of got that little hinge right in the middle. I'm not too fond of like red color baits. That one might work later on, but I'm definitely interested in trying this chartreuse black flake and then whatever whatever this is. It kind of looks like a glow in the dark material. I don't know, but we got one. And we got 10 jig heads. All of this for $3.99, which with the tax and shipping and all that mess, it will come to like $10.99 or something like that. But I'm gonna test this out today because I've got editing and some other stuff to do. So maybe tomorrow. We'll see you on the water then. All right, we're in the crappie spot. We're gonna try to catch at least one crappie per color. And if it comes down to it, we'll count, you know, one fish per color. Anyway. Let's get to snagging because that's probably what's going to happen. This is a little kit that we talked about in the beginning. It comes with 10 jig heads, four different colors, and a ton of bodies. I, I don't know how many bodies are there, like probably 10 a piece. They should put at least 20 jig heads in there. Anyway, I'm probably going to lose every one of these jig heads. So if push comes to shove, I'll go back to my vehicle and get some more jig heads. All right, little update. Um, lost and snagged the first four baits. So I've got six jig heads left. And what I'm gonna do is just cut them down about halfway and maybe, maybe that'll work. That'll definitely slow down the fall rate, which is a kind of an important deal with crappie fishing because crappie feed up and you get below them, a lot of times they won't bite. They still can, but a lot of times they won't. So I'm gonna cut them down and see if that changes anything. All right, I cut them down a little bit more than halfway. Well, about halfway, give or take. It's about the size of a Bobby Garland, just a little bit smaller, maybe. One day it started raining out of nowhere. It was raining sideways, big old fat raindrops. Shoot, it even rained at night. That is a good fish. We are hooked up. That is not a crappie. But it is another very, very large warmouth. I almost thought this was the one that I caught the other day, but it's not. It's smaller and a little bit different color patterns, but very, very pretty war mouse. Nope, not going to toss you back like I have been. All right, let's go change up. We got one on the glow in the dark color or pattern, whatever it is. I don't even know if this is glow in the dark. That's a large crappie. Oh, God. Do you see that? Do you freaking see that? I don't have a measuring tape, scale, or nothing down here with me. That is every bit of a 14 inch crappie. God, that was a huge crappie. Ooh. That's some heavy rain. You know, the sound of that rain falling off the bridge is pretty near relaxing. And that's not really a good thing since I've been up since like two o'clock this morning.
I don't know what you are, but you shot off like a rocket. Probably a yellow bass, if I had to guess. No. No, I was... Oh, God. Another massive, I mean, massive crappie. Dang it. I don't see what the hook is stuck in. There we go. That's every bit of a pound, pound and a quarter crappie. Probably 13, 14 inches. God, that's a big old crappie. <laughs> All right. I need another one. Another big one. Hey, this one ain't nearly as big as the last one, but it's still a good one. Good crappie. Another good, good crappie. That one right there is every bit of 11, 12 inches. Ooh, that was a real belly flop. I apologize for that, Mr. Crappie. Well, um, we've caught fish on three of the baits, or three of the colors, I should say. Maybe this rain moving in is getting them fired up. Another, another slab right in the middle of this rainstorm. And yeah, I really wish I'd brought a cooler and a stringer down here with me now, but we won't let this one go and see if we can catch a couple more. Hey, is it a crappie? Is it a crappie? Is it a crappie? Is it a crappie? Yes, it's a crappie. We touched it, so it counts. There it is. A crappie on every color bait. In the $3.99 Amazon crappie kit. Now, we're just fishing for whatever. No mistake there. I knew what that was. I kind of felt that tap. Another little slab donkey. Get a picture of him real quick and get it back. I'm about ready to confirm a suspicion that I've got. Chill, 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 chill. Chill, homie. Little G. C money. Actually, C money's pretty accurate term for these things. Because if you're into crappie fishing like hardcore, you're gonna be spending some money. No doubt when they when they're in their feeding mood, like after the storm rolled through, and the crappie got into their little feeding mood, you can definitely tell it's crappie just by how they bite. It's just a little tap, like a little thud on your jig head. Oh, I am very sorry for the belly flop. Chill. Oops, sorry about the rod being in y'all's face like that. Crappy. 
My numbers are going up for the year. Ooh. You got that one down a little bit. I might have to get my pliers for you. Chill, home slice. No, I got you out. Pretty little crappie. Like the big ones look good because they're a big crappie, but you know, something about the little ones. They just purtier. They write purty. second i gotta get pretty for the camera that's a lot of work actually anyway the 399 amazon crappie kit does it catch fish yeah it definitely catches fish um if they were feeding a little bit more actively you know post front because i've noticed in this particular spot here sorry we're under a bridge you can't tell but in this particular spot here post front is definitely a more productive time to fish this spot um but mid front post front or front seem to work pretty well but let's go over it again real quick you get four different colors 10 jig heads seven of which are down there on a stump so uh, i think you get like 10 or 12 something other like that bodies per color i'll leave a link in the description to where you can go check it out it's actually not a crappie specific kit it's just a the cheapest actual kit that popped up when i typed in crappie kit first couple of things were actually crappie magnets trout magnets stuff like that and i wasn't about to go that route because i've done it a thousand times before but anyway check it out link in the description get you some uh shipping and all they're like 10 bucks but i would definitely throw a couple packs of jig heads in there 10 is just not enough for what you've got here, especially if you fish in a very snaggy spot.